I'm a giver. That's my passion. I want to give back because I have so much. My main activity right now is volunteering at the RMMS Magnet School. Not so much training as a football player. Part of my job was making young men become better men. Back around 2008 or 9, I noticed a little gap in my stride. It got to the point where I couldn't lift my leg. Ray had pretty severe arthritis in both of his hips. He was limping, his quality of life had gone down dramatically very quickly. You know, in the period of within a year, uh, he went from being an extremely active individual, not only just coaching, but being there with the kids, many times working out with them. When I met Dr. Toms, he eased my mind and my heart. Each patient is different. The key is, though, to listen to them and to hear what they are bringing in, rather than just trying to do a cookie-cutter approach to, to everybody. Part of what I do is try and calm people down from that and say, it's okay, that's normal. It's a, it's a fully anticipated feeling that you have and fully validated. The pain outweighed the fear. Once I got over the fear, and once Dr. Toms and I had basically came together and communicated, I, I went to sleep and <laughs> woke up with a new hip. <laughs> After the replacement, they have shockingly little pain. You know, with the arthritis gone, they're able to get up and move. Instant gratification, pain gone. That right there, my friend, says it all. I'm walking around today, if I had not met Dr. Tom, I would have been in a wheelchair. Being able to speak to somebody face to face, you know, really helps out with understanding where they're coming from, where their goals are, what they want to get out of this. I would say to the people, whatever you do, don't hesitate. Don't, don't be afraid like I was. Get it done. This football is a gift from the children represents progress in family. And this is what you've taught us. I'm loving life.